not including RRR, what's your favorite movie of the year, Indian? New film. Has to be a new film. Mm. Okay. That's tough because there's, I have one that's my favorite, but then I have one that is like my favorite Oscar potential contender and they're different. Okay, what are they? So my favorite, and I'll, I won't remember the names, the, the one that is like the other Oscar contender is The, the Farmer. The right? Last Farmer. Yeah, The Last Farmer. But then probably as much as I loved, like, I loved Love Hostel, uh, the one that touched my heart the most that I would like the most people to see was Raj Kumar's. But I do. Yeah, but I but I is it but I do or but I do? No, but I do. But I do. But I do. In fact, I think he corrected us on that, didn't he? Yeah. Yeah, he lovingly went. Yeah. By the way, guys. But yeah, what about you? Because that 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 one for me is my probably my favorite. That one. Yeah, it's. Ranveer's film was. I well, that was in really, my head as well. Really, in terms of just enjoyable films. So, yeah, so was Topeka's. I really enjoyed Topeka's her film. Was good. I mean, and I I I really enjoyed Lal. So, all big hits. Yeah. at the box office. Big, massive. I mean, Lal is just which tearing is, it up. Which is why we loved it so much. Yeah. Hashtag go see Lal. <laughs> Your boy caught it. Just- Hey, welcome back to our stupid Rick's Eats Record. I'm Rick. Okay, let's get into the video. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we got a, a, a village cooking channel. Yes! This is called uh, Village Donuts. Tamil traditional snack. Uh, read this. Uluntu Vade. I think we had one. Welcomes you! I think we had one at the breakfast in Delhi. The donut. They look like donuts. I Did made we? I made it on the chan on on uh, me and my wife's channel, a uh, long time ago, but they're a little donut looking thing. Okay, I think right. That's what. That's they're savory. Savory, yeah. The sa- not not American donuts. <laughs> yeah, savory like almost. Um, Which Krispy Kreme has ruined me for all other donuts. There's no other donut I eat but Krispy Kreme glazed. None. It's because those are garbage. Krispy Kreme glazed. Yeah, there's like there's a, a place not too far. It's called Blinkies. It's up in uh, Woodland Hills. Way better original glazed donut than uh, Krispy Kreme. Does it melt in your mouth and make you want to have an orgasm? Uh, yes. Okay, I'm gonna go. It, I'm gonna check it out. It doesn't. It doesn't make you. It. It, you it do. is. It is an it orgasm. Is, it is the orgasm. That's actually wow. the glaze. The glaze is orgasm. Yes. from the chef. Yes, I'm not eating it. <laughs> Talk about saying welcomes you. <laughs> Stupid. Thank you. Anyways, here we go. <laughs> They're gonna have to soak that. It's another one of those. How long did they probably have to soak that? At least seven minutes. Really? That's it? No, it's uh, uh, hours. Okay. <laughs> Oh, Ned, welcome to you. Looks like a penis. It does. Circumcised. Or fully erect. No. Because all of them look the same when they're fully erect. How would you know? I, did you not know that? This must take him hours. Oh, what if he smashes his fingers? That wouldn't feel good. Wow. Yeah, how long does he have to do that? Seven minutes. Is everything with you seven minutes? Yeah. (laughs) Not too long, not too short. (laughs) It's just a perfect amount of time. Oh, mashed potatoes. That he's gonna be there a while. That's gotta take him. This is yeah. Well, that 
was one of those and look at all of that. <laughs> I wish it were subs, man. Whoa. A lot of goats. Oh, that was satisfying. Nine days later. I wonder what that is. Grinding it into flour. <laughs> the subtitles on this are insane. Oh, oh looks be, like it's be looks fun. like he's massaging somebody. It'd be fun to bathe in. And I think it's still got a ferment too. Now that looks like mashed potatoes. I love I fire his hypnotic man. Everything about it. Sight, smell, sound. One of my favorite sounds in the world is a crackling fire. That's mine. They, they poke the hole right before they put it in. Yeah, I see that. They poke the hole right. <laughs> it, it always makes things better when you do that. <laughs> <laughs> Little donuts. Do you remember? I think we, we had these at that place, but it was in Delhi, so it doesn't count. Yeah, that looks very familiar. Yes. You dip it in the yeah, chutney. Yeah, you dip it. I remember that was one of the first things we ate. Yeah. Oh, I remember people were so mad at us for going to the place first. <laughs> we were just following the lead of others, man. It was good, too. Yeah. Look like hush puppies almost. Coconut? Making a coconut chutney? Wow, they really got everything out of it, didn't they? And then are they going to sprinkle the coconut all over the top of it? No, I think they're going to make it chutney. You know, Indians don't just eat plain things. Yeah. Going to dip that bad boy. 
Yep. I used a blender. Ah, mustard seeds. Those are my enemy. Mustard seeds are my enemy. Because they pop. Oh, they destroy me. Oh, and Dronny will be cooking in the kitchen and she's busting out the mustard oil and the chilies. I can't stand in there five seconds because my face is burning off. And she's like, what, babe? I'm like, how do you, how do you do it? Great sounds in this video. Incredible sounds in this video. Taking me to very happy places in my mind. So satisfying. It's like cherries. Garlic. Mm. Mm. Ooh, that looks tasty. Yep. It's my favorite vegetable, the onion. Oh, that looks amazing. It does. Ah, oh, salt. You heard about the peanut who went to the police office and filed a report? He was assaulted. Thank you very much. Teeth are involved in that one. <laughs> Reminds me of a simpler time. <sighs> banana leaves. Yep, banana leaves for the little servings. Oh, oh, three different kinds. Is that what's going on? Or just two? Oh yeah, tear yeah. that. Yeah, get Scoop in there. that yeah, up. Yeah. yeah, eat it. Mmm. Oh. I would eat that. Well, I would try. I don't know if I could handle the heat, but absolutely. Oh, That's probably my favorite thing of, at the very, very end because is there, there's nothing more practical, more practically helpful or personally connecting than, than feeding uh, somebody. What? Than feeding somebody. It's the most practical, personal thing that you could do to help somebody out is getting some something food. a little more personal. Practical and helpful. Oh, it's practical. It's primal too. But this is also good. <laughs> Corbin's the guy who sits at a at like a, a, a TED talk about world hunger <laughs> and somebody says something off color. And for the rest of the talk, Corbin's laughing because he's got sex things going on in his mind. Yeah, yeah, that's about right. <laughs> 100% right. 
<laughs> I'm usually tapped out by then. Yeah. So it's uh, <laughs> sex is funny. Uh, oh, fun fact. They were eating on banana leaves. I was like, oh, I've always wanted to have a banana leaf. Eat on a banana leaf. Yeah. Just, uh, they sell them right across the street. At that guy's house? No. Oh. Vallarta. Do they really? Which makes sense. Yeah, I guess it does if you think about it. Mexican culture also yeah. uses banana leaf it for different is, things. The, the similarities and are And Ronnie is consistently marveling at how similar Mexican culture they're is to so Indian culture. so different, but they're also in so, so many ways. similar. Yeah, just Latin culture, Latin in, culture general, in general. But general. But Mexican's the one we're really close to here in, in SoCal. But just Latin culture in general, Latin food, Latin music, uh, so many similarities. There's, but they're also extremely the, different. Extremely different, But they too. also have so many similarities that just... I think they're two cultures that... Well, they're very similar in terms of where they are on the equator, so that probably has a lot to do with it. Probably. Just where you are on Earth. And the types of foods that you can get from those regions. Um, but yeah, I was like, Yo, so if we, if you guys know anything cool that we can eat on, uh, or traditional that we haven't eaten, that we could eat on a banana leaf, you know, we, I know where yeah, to get them now. We haven't done that. We haven't done, done like a, a, a really traditional South banana Indian, leaf, South Indian yeah, served uh, kind of thing. Be cool. Um... We just need to let Micah has said, if you, in case you were wondering, because Alexis has been back, Ashley's been back, Micah has specifically said, just let me know when you got food. Granted, only uh, Ashley has been here. Lexi hasn't been here since we came I here? Don't think Lexi's been at this house. I could be wrong. I think you might be right on that. I think it may just be Ash. So we'll have Granted, to get Lexi here. We haven't been here that long, but true. Yeah. Um, anyways. Another great video. Always. Please let us know what the other videos of theirs and other food videos. And if you know what we should eat on a banana leaf, let me know. Or should we just eat the banana leaf? Yeah, let's have Corbin eat a banana leaf. Mmm, scrumptious. Let us know down below. Juice!